right. Um, let's see. Did you ever re-add me in this, Carl? No. Alright, I'm gonna wait till you add me before I accept, because I can only accept one more person right now. Oh my gosh. Yeah. All right. Hello, everyone. We're going to get started tonight on book two. I don't know how far I can play before it'll tell me I need to, like, level up more. Oops. Um... The usurper, us, usurper of the wilds. Oh, this is already a battle. Yikes. <laughs> well, I have... I did level up my team a little bit today, so let's, let's see how it goes. Oh, I wish I'd leveled up Jamil a little bit more. Oof, we'll see. I might have to redo it. Scrambling for a meal. I can turn on the lights. Oops. I can hear the wind. Oh, so now my character is having these flashbacks for the Lion King. It's interesting we're starting to hey welcome welcome witty welcome to the stream ramshackle dorm <laughs> my god hello rice's life welcome to the stream welcome to oh nice of you to join us first time viewer welcome laquita just meowed um Oh my god. We were waiting for our friend to tell us what game we were going to stream, but she didn't tell us because she was busy. And now she just, of course, as soon as I started this, she just texted. So I might have to tell her, I might tell her to give me like 15 minutes so I can at least play a couple rounds really quick. Uh, was that a roar? My first watch, my first watch stream. Well, welcome. <laughs> Excuse me. What you get for crossing Grim to Mighty. Um, Grim, wake up. Oh my gosh, it's so noisy. So many noises coming from your side. That's right, cower before me, teapot tyrant. There you are. Huh? Where am I? Oh man, I was dreaming that I was uh, trouncing Riddle with my magic. You should have seen his face. Okay. Um, that was a rough couple days. I'm still exhausted. All right, let me just fix my bedhead. Then it's off to class. I've got magic to master. Ah, oh, Professor Train must have cast a sleeping spell on me. I fought to stay awake, but he was so boring. Hello, Faith. Yeah, fought, sure. I heard you snoring five minutes in. Weekend vibes. Hey, Trixie. Grub, what's it gonna be today? Huh? Wait, what's going on? Why is it so crowded in here? That famous bakery from out of town is serving up their goods. It only happens once a month. Their stock sells out so fast, you so you better hurry. Give me three of those chocolate croissants. I actually snagged an egg sandwich this month. These things are amazing. Egg sandwiches are now sold out. Only one deluxe ham and cheese left. Oh man, everything looks amazing. I'm going to see if I can grab something. Wow, they really do seem popular. What do you want? Huh? Uh, where did... Oh, let's see. Where did Grim go? Hey, out of my way, losers. 
That girl cheese is mine. Hey, no cutting. A freshman cutting in front of an upperclassman. Time to learn you some manners. He's got such a one-track mind when it comes to food. Are you talking to... Um, let's go stop him. He's gonna anger the no eyes. Yeah, they're the real villains of this story. Let's be honest. Oh, I we really did anger the no eyes. Okay, I took away the whole. Um, I'm actually now doing battles not um, not automatically because that was a hot mess disaster. <laughs> Well, it got to be even too hard to do it that way. So now I'm, like, actually playing the battles. Yikes. Um, like, everybody is weak. Okay, there we go. Hello, Cloudy! Well, 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 if it isn't easy easiest to the cats, welcome. Wait, wait, even their chibis don't have eyes, what? I mean, it's a very important design choice. Well, that's good, I did some leveling up today, so... I'm glad that my team is a little stronger now. The way I'm curling doll hair while watching the stream. <laughs> what? Maybe we'll get enough to do a ten a ten pull. Hello, KNL. Welcome. They say hello, husband. Hello. <laughs> Ha, guess who scored the last deluxe grilled cheese sandwich? This guy. That's why they call me Grim the Great. I also snagged a bear claw and a cronut. Grim, you need to learn some restraint. I'm really sorry, guys. Yo, Pops, give me one of those roast beef sandwiches. Hey, you're cutting in line too. Rats, looks like I'm late for monthly bakery battle royale. Oh, it's Ruggy. And now they're sold out of the grilled cheese Leona sent me to buy for him. I'm going to savor the flavor of this victory. Pardon me, friend. I see you were able to get your hands on the highly prized deluxe grilled cheese sandwich. Incredible. Huh? Who are you, and what do you want with my meat? <laughs> <laughs> that is the question. Is Carl liking the game too so far? I, I am. I like the story, actually. I like following it and reading it. I normally don't like reading my games. <laughs> But I actually enjoy this. Um, oh, I'm just a guy who really, really wanted to buy that sandwich you've got there, but arrived a smidge too late. Speaking of which, here's a proposition for you. Might you be willing to trade your deluxe grilled cheese for this exciting hot dog bun? What? You must be out of your mind, dude. Oh, come on now. Let's not be like that. Here, have the hot dog bun. I insist. What in the name of tuna? My paws are moving on their own. Um... Exciting hot dog bun. <laughs> Sounds like we have ourselves a deal. What luck that I found a kind soul willing to trade. You enjoy that hot dog bun. I do hope you can find something to fill it with. That is... <laughs> that is suggestive. That's all I'm going to say. Maybe a squirt of ketchup would imitate the real thing. Anyway, nice doing business with you, toodles. Ruggy, I'm going to need you to take it down five notches. My grilled cheese, my deluxe grilled cheese. Ah oh, man, this is the worst day of my empathetic life. I could barely choke down my lunch. You just ate three pastries in 10 seconds. I still don't get why you even traded at all. I didn't. It's like when he put out his hand, my paw just shot out, like it was copy in his. What'd she say? She said, Fortnite Paladins? It all happened so fast, like a gear deer caught in the sandwich stealing headlights. No, it wasn't like that at all, but I I don't know how to explain it. Ah, oh, this stinks. I need to eat my feelings. Stat! Deuce, give me a bite of your pasta. No way, you made your bread, now lie in it. Oh, by the way, guys, the head mage said he had something he wanted to, uh, to tell us after class. No clue what it could be, though. Probably has something to do with what happened to House Warden Rosehearts a few days ago. When he went all berserker mode on us? Yeah, I bet you're right. 
Maybe he wants to lavish me with a smorgasbord of succulent fish for all my hard work that day. I am grim. I too want to eat my feelings. Disney be getting naughty in their dormitories. <laughs> yeah, dream on, furball. Uh, you know that guy who came by earlier? I feel like we've seen him somewhere before. Temperate zone. Leona, lunch is served, my friend. Is it noon already? Don't tell me you've been sleep. I've been asleep all morning. You're going to fail more of your core classes. Smells like you actually got what I asked you for. Barely. Must you always request the most popular item on the bakery day? Anyway, here, one deluxe grilled cheese and an iced tea. Are you brain dead? The fact that it's hard to get is exactly what makes me want it so bad. Me, I'll eat anything, so long as it isn't moldy. But as a prince, I doubt you could relate. Your Highness. <laughs> I ain't like, um, I ain't, it ain't like I'm first in line for succession. I'm second, so I probably won't ever be king. I'm practically a commoner, really. That reminds me of the time you mistook a picture of my family's home for a doghouse. <laughs> oh my god. Did I really do that? You really did. I wish my perspective was so warped from a life of luxury. Nah, the royal life stinks, honestly. All that matters is the order of your birth. Hard work and talent basically mean nothing. Hmm, I guess I could see that being a drag. Oh, by the way, there's a housewarming meeting after school today about the spell drive tournament. Please try to actually show up. Ugh, what a headache. As house warden, you get the biggest room in the dorm. You could at least make an, a token effort to do the corresponding job. All right, already, fine, stop whining. Uh, now that my belly's full, I'm ready for another snooze. Wake me after lunch break is over. Not your alarm clock, alarm clock, Leona. You know I have my own, uh, he's already out. Wow. <laughs> anyway, that weasel at the cafeteria and his freshman friends uh, where have I seen them before? Her and Ryan are getting on what? Fortnite. Fortnite. I told her I was on there now, so... Alright, I'm gonna do three more missions, so I get up to five. And then I'm going to stop. So I did say this is probably going to be a short stream because we're going to play some Fortnite. I don't know if I'm going to stream Fortnite or not. I don't know. Um, so I'm going to get up to chapter uh, chapter five and then I'll and then I'll end the stream. So it'll just be a short little stream, but I'll stream more tomorrow during the day. Um, Fun fact, Leona is 20 years old. Violet de demonstration. Headmage, may we come in? How's it going, sir? Ah, thank you all for coming. I'll get right to the point. Now that the Hearts Labule incident is behind us, I wanted to give you a proper debriefing on the matter. If you are to become mages, you need to fully understand the mal uh, malady that befell Mr. Rosehearts. You called it Overblot, right? Yes, that is correct. My brother told me a little about that. He said that could happen to anyone who builds up too much block. Sounds like Cater has was pretty much on the nose with Berserker mode. Yeah, but what is blot anyway? Ah, uh, indeed, for the, your sake and Jason's, it would behoove us to start with the basics. I shall teach you all you need to know. Charity, thy name is Crowley. <laughs> Now, blot is a form of waste that is created as a byproduct of using magic. Just as cars run on gasoline and in the process expel dangerous gases as exhaust, casting spells consumes magical energy and in the process expels blot. Um, who knew magic could have a carbon footprint? Quite. Research into the nature of blot has been conducted since time immemorial, and yet we still understand little about it. All we know for sure is that it is terrifically toxic and excessive amounts, can wreak havoc on a mage's mind and body. I guess that's why Grandma was always nagging me to not overdo it with magic, huh? Oh, didn't know he was 20. Glad to see someone close to my age. Here I thought she just didn't want me to break stuff. Power and peril are two sides of the same coin. Even the greatest of mages cannot cast spell after spell without consequences. So you're telling me I'm gonna get sick if I keep using magic whenever I want? Not necessarily. Hmm, perhaps a demonstration would prove more efficient than a mere explanation. Ghosts, assemble. I have a job for you. You summoned us, head mage? Not these guys again. Would you be so kind as to help me put these young students through their paces? 
This seems like a bad idea. Yeah, okay, we'll go around uh, or two of them. Now, students, ready your magical pens. Prepare to receive a special lesson from your head mage. Please, not the marshmallow ghosts. Uh, nothing I have is strong against them, so that's concerning. Can you let them know I'll be on in, like, 15, 10, 15 minutes? Laquita got a voice lesson today. What happened? I mean, we could we could play it and jump out as soon as he's on. All right, that was easy. <laughs> that was like oh, so uneventful. So after two five, I'll 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 finish up. And what do you guys are you guys interested in watching Fortnite? Um, would you guys be interested in me doing Fortnite? I would end this stream and start a new one so that it creates two different videos on my page so that people who are following um, Twisted Wonderland could just watch this. They don't have to watch the Fortnite part. But let me know if you guys would want me to stream that. Hey, Head Mage, what's the deal? What does fighting ghosts got to do with block? Direct your attention to the Mage Stone on your collar, Mr. Grimm. It's like having friends hang out. Oh, cool. My mage stone looks all grungy now. It won't rub off. Precisely. That inky black stain is the byproduct of spellcasting known as blot. There's some grime on my magical pen, too. You know, this is a capital G gross. Um, will it come off eventually? It will. Phew, had me worried there. With sufficient rest, Blot will vanish from your Mage Stone. This is why Mage Stone is so valuable to magic users. Not only does it aid your casting, it also serves as a lightning rod of sorts to prevent Blot from accumulating within the caster. I see, so when our Mage Stones start to get cloudy, that means it's time for us to ease off. I just got back and I don't know what I'm agreeing to, but yes. I was uh, saying, I was asking if I should also stream Fortnite, because after in, um, I'm going to do two more story missions, and then I'm going to play uh, jump over to Fortnite with Carl and our friend Laquita. Gotcha. So when I become an even greater mage, I'll be able to fire off spells left and right. Pew pew. After all, I do plenty of sleeping and eat. People vary greatly in their capacity for magic. However, save for a few key exceptions, there is little variance in most mages' tolerance for blot. What's that mean? In essence, it means that those who possess a great capacity for magic must be meticulous in their efforts to avoid accumulating blot. Like Mr. Mo Rosehearts, for instance. So folks who know their way around magic gotta lay off once in a while. Seems simple enough. Correct. That said, it isn't anything that mages at your level need to worry about. How very fortunate for you. I guess that's uh, only kind of an insult. <laughs> anyway, I think I get it. Use magic, get blot, blot bad, sleep, and food good. <laughs> but is that really all it took to make Riddle active, uh, activate Berserker mode? The accumulation of blot is significantly affected by the sorcerer's mental state. Anger, fear, panic, sorrow. Harboring those sorts of negative energies uh, hastens the accumulation of blot by a significant degree. This in turn leads to the dreadful state known as overblot. Negative energies, huh? Interesting. Do you recall the giant shadow that appeared behind Mr. Rosehearts? Such manifestations are believed to be the result of a fusion between blot and negative energies. I'm afraid that's the extent of what current studies have revealed to us, however. There remain many mysteries surrounding overblot. After all, there are not many opportunities for study and observation. Let's hope it stays that way. It is fortunate that we were able to snap Mr. Rosehearts out of it so quickly, if that had been allowed to continue. It is a prospect too terrifying to consider! What's your problem, yelling out of the blue like that? 
Forgive me, I lost my composure. In summary, the use of magic is always accompanied by a certain degree of risk, and I expect you all to keep that in mind. Yes, sir. Thus concludes your special lesson from the head mage himself. How wonderfully kind of me. Now back to your classrooms with you. Um, so have you found a way to send me home? Yeesh, that dude. You and your friends are fun. Oh, thank you. Ah, yes. A means to send Jason home, right? I have been diligently searching for one, of course. I have certainly not forgotten. It is merely that I have been quite busy of late. Your eyes got all shifty all of a sudden. I'm certainly not lying. The October Interdurm uh, Spell Drive Tournament is consuming a great deal of my attention at the moment. In fact, I have a meeting with the assembled house wardens immediately after this. What's a Spell Drive Tournament? Seems like this tournament is probably going to be an important part of whatever this thing is. All right, one more, and then I'm gonna uh, I'll end this stream and I'll jump over to Fortnite. <laughs> Spell drive tournament, come again. Dude, you've never heard of a spell drive? It's a world-famous sport. There's even a pro league and world championship tournament. I ain't never heard of this neither. Spell drive is a sport played by competing teams of seven people. Basically, players battle for control of a disc and earn points by driving it into the enemy's team's goal. The team with the most points wins. Um, a disc? Sign me up! I'm like, apparently my character's like really into discs. Oh yeah, you a big sports fan? If you're interested, we could go check out the school spell drive league sometime. Oh man, I just realized that Jason would have a hard time actually playing. Yeah, why's that? You need magic to play. Not only do you move the disc with magic, but you use it to attack and defend too. The flashier the magic, the better. It's how players show off their skills. Yes, quite. That is why Night Raven College is known throughout the world as a leader in the sport. This school has produced countless pro players. Hello, anime lover. Uh, that's why our interdom, interdorm spell drive tournaments attract attention even from pro league recruiters. Also, those simply looking for up and coming magicians use the event to scout hopeful candidates. Yes, the tournament is quite an affair. The campus will be full of visitors and lined with various kiosks, and the main event will be captured by television cameras and broadcast worldwide. Um, wow, that's incredible. It's broadcast through the world? So you're saying that if I were to play in this tournament and win, of course, the whole world would see it? Of course! Players who excel at the tournament invariably attract great attention. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. I needed that. Both uh, from the pro leagues and the public at large. In your case, the magic would barely even matter. Just having a monster like you out there is sure to turn heads. It's settled then. I'm going to train around the clock, join a team, and become a legend. Alas, Grim, you cannot enter. Wait, what? Did you not hear me speak the word interdorm multiple times? Your dorm doesn't even have seven members, therefore you cannot enter the tournament. No fair. But there's plenty else to do, from tending to the grounds to selling drinks in the stands. Oh, brutal. Before I have to switch to Fortnite, I have to do a bean boozled. Oh. All right, all right, all right. My day has been all right. How has your day been? What the? Oh, oh my God. All right, so <laughs> this could either be strawberry banana smoothie or dead fish. Oh, I haven't seen it. Dead fish. I don't know. Okay. okay no, oh. <laughs> so we have to do damage while in this thing. Tell Aquita I just ate a bean boozled that is flavored as dead fish. She or barf. It might be barf. And barf. Ugh, I think it's barf. Think or it's dead fish. No, it might be dead fish. Barf is the worst, she said. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, barf and dead fish kind of taste the same. Yeah, it's fish barf. Oh my it's god. Fish barf? Oh my god, it's so bad. <laughs> it's like layers to the flavor. Sure. Ugh! 
Oh, okay, okay. It's not obnoxious enough? What? Mm. Oh, the horn? <laughs> yeah, do that. I only have to eat it, not some some Elliot. What? <laughs> it says destroy what? The ob objects while driving the quad crash. I feel like it got stuck on my <laughs> tongue and now I'll go away. What? Oh, that was so bad. That was so bad. Wait, did you oh my god. I will never recover from that. Those who stand upon the field are not the only stars of tournament today. Not interested. Oh, Ninja Haru, I'm so glad that got a subscription. You were like, I like watching this guy suffer eating these devil jelly beans. You definitely didn't need to savor it. You'll be breathing that the rest of the night. Oh, gross. I want to be on TV. I want everyone in the world fawning over me. Grim is so cool. Did you see that player Grim, play Grim mate? You know what I'm saying. Your delusions are oddly specific, dude. Well, if you can't field a team, I'm afraid that's that. Maybe next year, Ramshackle House will get some new members, but it's not happening this year. Anyway, as I believe I've mentioned, I'm a busy man. I must be off. Yeah, thanks for taking time out of your busy day to build up my dreams and crush them. Ooh. OMG, I'm both sorry and amused. <laughs> oh, Oh, the next chap release conditions. Oh, see, this is perfect. I can't even do the next one because I have to be rank seven. How do you even do um, in this thing? <laughs> so, it was meant to be that that was where I would stop. Look at that. Congrats on your Zhao, by the way. Oh, did anime lover get Zhao? I didn't see that. That's awesome. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I think Carl added me. Let's see if I can find him here. Laquina! Are you down? So, I before I stream next time, I have to get to oh rank 7. <laughs> so, I'm gonna end this stream so that all of my Twisted Wonderland stuff is like individual videos. And then I have to switch up some chords, and in about five minutes I'm gonna get on Fortnite. So feel free to jump in and watch Fortnite for a little bit if that's not your thing. I hope you have an awesome night. Um, you got Deluke as well. Oh, I'm so jealous. I haven't played Genshin at all this week because I've been playing so much Twisted Wonderland. Um, so I'm gonna be on, I'll be on Fortnite in probably about five minutes, I would say. So, like I said, if that's your. If that's your jam, feel free to jump on. Oh, Ninja Haru, thank you so much for the for the bits. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, if that if Fortnite's your thing, I'll see you there. And if not, I hope you have an awesome night. And I will be twisting some twisted. I will be twisting. I will be streaming some Twisted Wonderland tomorrow, probably during the day. Um, my sister was playing Twisted Wonderland earlier. Um, so if you're around, feel free to jump in and say hi, because I'll probably be streaming. For, I'm going to try and get to rank 7, just like I'll have my phone in the background tonight, uh, playing to try and get to rank 7. And, um, I'll probably play tomorrow around, like, noon or 1. So if you're around, I'll probably play for a couple hours. So, oh, thank you for the stretch. Customer service video just came out. Customer service voice just came out. My customer service voice? Um... Oh my gosh. Oh, take your time. Oh my god, Carl's foot is on my shoulder. Ugh, what is happening? Did you guys play a game today? Jesus. Alright guys, um, I'll be back in a few minutes with Fortnite. <laughs>